I run this sawmill in the afternoon until fairly late at night. I end up with a pile of slabs. The following morning, I get up earlier than most of my neighbors, so I, I like to come up here and get rid of the slabs, get them and get cleaned up before the following night when I'm using it again. It's too early in the morning to really run a gas chainsaw, so I bought this um, originally to basically cut these slabs up in the morning. It's quiet. Now, I've had it for a month and a half now. I found now I'm leaving it on the back of one of my trucks. I'm a landscape company. This will pretty much cut a tree up, I found out, with one battery. So if you go to do a, a spring cleanup, I do a few spring cleanups. I keep care of some commercial properties. You go there. Uh, I went to one the other day. There was a tree down from the winter. So it, it cut the whole tree up, brush and all, on one battery. So I'm going to probably keep this in the truck. I bought it originally to basically cut slabs, but I have found now it's, it's actually a capable chainsaw. Uh, I just want to show that in this video, but like these are the slabs I normally cut up in the morning. Plenty capable, like I'm gonna cut the end of this log just to show you it's got plenty of power. To... Like I said, it's a 60 volt flex volt, they call it. Um, but like I said, it's a good size battery. But that battery, uh, you can cut up a good sized tree brush and all, load it in your truck with one battery. I did go out, I wanted to get an extra battery for it. I found, I thought it was better to buy this tool. So I ended up buying this blower. Same thing in the morning, it's quiet compared to a gas powered one, but I can clean the mill up in the morning. They get pretty, a lot of sawdust gets packed in where the the blade is so I can open the door blow that all out like I said no one gets aggravated early in the morning they're fairly quiet but um, you open these up like I said now this will Even this is way more capable than I thought it would be. I'm used to, I got commercial gas powered backpack blowers. I normally run a Husqvarna Rancher. Um, I have bigger saws than that, but like I said, that's normally, uh, I'm just used to, that's capable. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm that guy 10 years ago that would say I would have never bought a battery pack uh, chainsaw. <laughs> And now I've got that. I think this is what's going to be on the back of the truck all the time rather than just another gas thing you got to deal with all the time. a fairly fresh oak tree that I just cut so like I said it's very capable um, I found you can the trees that come down over the winter that I cleaned up 
probably half the side size uh, white birch, but it cleaned, it cut the whole tree up down to the stump, all the brush and everything on that one battery. So I just want to showcase that these are way more capable. And I was definitely that guy that would have never believed that one of these would be as capable as it is. So I just wanted to do a short video and show people. Any homeowner would be more than satisfied with this for anything you're ever going to do. That, and if you don't use it all the time, like the problem with the gas stuff, the new gas we have, if it sits for six months, you go to start it, it doesn't start good because it's water in the gas or whatever, the carburetors get dirty. This here, I believe, I don't believe you're, it doesn't, it ain't going to have those issues. 